Inside LSU Gymnastics with DD Bro is brought to you each week by Sigma Engineers. Sigma Engineers is thankful to our clients who trust us year after year and to the commitment of our selfless employees who bring such great talents to our company. With experts in every discipline, our dedication to safety and quality sets us apart as one of the leaders in the petrochemical industry. Woman's Hospital, the best birthday ever is at Woman's. TJ Ribs, legendary Louisiana barbecue, and by Assurance Financial. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Insurance Financial. Lending the way home buyers prefer it. Inside LSU Gymnastics with DD Bro is an exclusive presentation of the LSU Sports Television Network. Welcome inside LSU Gymnastics from the LSU Gymnastics Training Center in Baton Rouge. I'm your host, Mike Smith, along with Hall of Fame head coach, Dee Dee Bro. Dee Dee, what a fantastic way to start the 2017 season in the Maravich Center on Friday night. An unbelievable crowd. The girls in the locker room, the team was ready to go. You had this team primed and ready for a tremendous kickoff to the season. You know, Mike, we talk about the village and everybody in our village, everybody that works so hard to make our events and make this team what it is, mm -hmm. uh, we couldn't have scripted it to be better than it was. It, uh, it was a fabulous night. The team comes out of the locker room and gets to witness the banner drop after the introductions, recognizing the 2016 Super 6 and national runner-up finish for the Fighting Tigers. And then Dee Dee, some dignitaries in the house to honor you for uh, 700 career victories and counting, none other than the governor of Louisiana and his wife. Well, it was, it was to have John, Bell, and Donna there, but you know, Dr. Alexander and his wife and Joe Oliva and Annie were there, and it was just really a, a special night, and, and I guess that's a lot of victories, you know? And <laughs> so we were really excited, you know, the kids from, from the locker room and all of our preparation and everything that, the, that they do to prepare for the competition, and then that incredible open opening and uh, to drop that banner that means so much to us and our fans and um, then to be honored by you know so many wonderful wonderful people that mean so much to me and my family and everybody that was there and um, then to start that competition uh -huh. with with uh -huh. such an in incredible positive force and how about all the opening taken live by the SEC network yeah. and broadcast all over a uh, lot of great fan reaction yeah. to what folks were able to see well, Dady, let's just jump right into the highlights of this meet. And as always, this week's highlights are brought to you by TJ Ribs, the official barbecue restaurant of LSU Tigers. So, Dee, the vault right off the bat. Uh, Juliana Canamella starts you off. And, you know, some of the, some of the team members after the, the meet said that it may not have been her score, but it was the manner in which she nailed that vault that set the tone for the Tigers on Friday night. Well, it's how you do what you do. And, you know, we wanted, we wanted some stuck vaults. We wanted some kids to, to get high in the air and dart. And that's exactly where Juliana, you know, started us off. And let's, you know, go backwards national championships. That's how she ended her season last year with a beautiful stuck vault. So to begin the season this year, that was incredible. And then it just kind of followed right down the line. You know, everybody as they went did beautiful vaults. Yeah. Um, a lot of execution, a lot of great execution. I know Bob was very, very <laughs> pleased. Lots of enthusiasm going on on that on that end of the end of the floor. And I'll tell you, the enthusiasm seemed to hit a peak in the lineup in the fourth spot. A tiger, her very first event, and that's Kid Kennedy Edney. Her very first event as a fighting tiger, and wow, what an amazing effort. You know, it's always exciting when a freshman does that well, and her mom and grandmother were here from California, and you know, and you look up in the parent section and you see all of that pride <laughs> and all of that passion, and then, you know, just, and then for her to come down that runway and execute such a beautiful vault and stick it and see that face light up like it did. And then, <laughs> and then her picture was in the paper in the advocate the next day with, you know, this giant smile. So it was uh, really, really a great night for her. A 995 to start the career of Kennedy Edney. Lots and lots of great things to come yeah. for her. But we weren't done yet over on the over on the vault. Maya Hambrick and Ashley Nad, a couple of all Americans yeah. who are no strangers to big scores. Well, Maya's vault starts at a 995. That's right. So you look at her score and that was a pretty perfect vault. It was absolutely gorgeous. And then, you know, Bugs the 10 0 vault. It starts with a 10 because it's double twist. Um, you, you open the meet, open the season with that kind of performance and that kind of team core 
teams mm -hmm. score, you know that you've got a core of vaulters that can really, really vault. And then we've got some kids that didn't make the lineup. So we're, we're kind of excited about what's going on here. 49-5-2-5 on the vault to start the 2017 campaign, Dee Dee. And then it's over to the uneven bars that you go. And again, it seemed like you picked up where you left off in 2016. The Tigers absolutely sterling on the event. You know, one thing that... Um, Jay talks about all the time is the the battle of perception mm -hmm. and he's a master uh, at you know getting over there on bars and and having the kids do their assignment and do it really well and I think hitting their handstands and being aggressive throughout the routine and attacking their dismounts was a, a kind of a, a benchmark of what we want to see these kids do throughout the season um, the first person up mm -hmm. was fabulous Shay Zamardi got us started did a great mm -hmm. job um, nice handstand positions, aggressive swing, a little bit of deduction in the dismount, but everything else about that routine was a great start set. And I'd like to highlight Sarah Finnegan with a 9-9 DD. Wow, that is a young lady that we expect some big things from in the 2017 season. Well, she's just got beautiful execution, and you, you go from her hands to her toes, and you see the stretch in, in her body lines and amplitude and in which she does everything, and then a, a beautiful, nice high double layout. I just, we just saw so many good things throughout the entire lineup that led to the end of the lineup. Lexi Priestman was able to, you know, hit it out of the park, and um, you know, Absolutely. when you do that kind of amplitude, nice and high to Kachev, and she follows it with a big mm -hmm. pack salto, and then a well-executed, beautifully stuck double layout. Um, I, know, I was just, I was very, very pleased with the entire lineup. Well, you and Jay both, 49-375 to start the 2017 season on the uneven bars for the Fighting Tigers of LSU. And when we come back after this short break, we'll take a look at the second half of the Tigers and the Georgia Gym Dogs in the Maravich Center. You're watching Inside LSU Gymnastics. This gymnastics moment brought to you by Sigma Engineering. Sigma Engineers and Constructors. Safety, relationships, quality, excellence. Engineering done right. You're a mom the moment you see that second line. And it's time to get ready because this birthday takes months to plan. Find the doctor who just clicks with you. Make a birth plan that's right for you. Because every woman wants something different, even you and your BFF. And when it's finally time, our doctors and nurses will be by your side as you bring your beautiful baby into this world. The best birthday ever is at Woman's. What's wrong, big guy? All I wanted was a chance to play today. You know it's tough, kid, but we've both been in your shoes before. Yeah, right. You guys are great. Come on, I have someone you want to meet. You know the only way to become great to learn from a legend. Billy Cannon! Hey, gang, come on in here. We're going to talk some football. More people than ever are choosing Nissan, making us North America's fastest-growing auto brand in 2016. Take on 2017 and get the safety you'd expect. And America's best truck warranty. Get to Nissan's Take On 2017 event for 0% financing for up to 72 months on 11 models or save up to 10000 on select models. Get to Nissan, a proud partner of the LSU Tigers. Go Tigers! At LSU, we're pretty competitive. We helped prove Einstein's theories about gravity. Nailed it. France designated our French program as a center of excellence. We've discovered 41 species of birdies. LSU, we're pretty competitive because we're here to win. What are y'all doing here so early? Oh, Dee Dee, we're so excited that we just wanted to get some extra vaults in. Balding for victory, right? LSU gymnastics tickets are less than the movies and fun for the family. Tickets start at just $3, so make sure to get yours today. This segment of Inside LSU Gymnastics is brought to you by TJ Ribs. 
TJ Ribs, legendary Louisiana barbecue. Today's exceptional performance is brought to you by Woman's Hospital. The best birthday ever is at Woman's. Dee Dee, a great opportunity to highlight a young lady who also, like Kennedy Edney, first time in the lineup as yeah. a fighting tiger on balance beam, and that was Lauren Lee, and what a fantastic effort. Yeah, she did great. I, I really cherish that third spot. I mm. think it's critical and as important as the first spot because it supports the end of the lineup. And this is her first time to go in and compete for a score that's going to count and make a difference. And to go in under that kind of pressure, um, big time, live, you know, TV, SEC network, and she just hits it out of the park. We couldn't ask Lauren Lee to do a better job on beam and gives us a 9.85, and I think she set up the end of the lineup. She really did, because then you go almost 9.9 nine or better the rest of the way. In the fourth spot, Sydney Ewing. How great is it to see her back yeah. up on that beam? The former walk-on is just in now in her senior year. Time sure has flown, but she just does an outstanding job on this event. Well, you know, she does, but I, let, let's... Aaron Mekadeg, yes, been out, couldn't couldn't practice, a little fracture in her foot. Dr. Bankston cleared her the day before, goes up and rocks the house, does a beautiful job for us. And then Maya Hambrick, mm -hmm. Lauren Lee, I mean every single person in that in that beam lineup did a fabulous job. You get to Sarah Finnegan, triple uh -huh. turn, it's absolutely marvelous. And then sticks her dismount, sets up Ashley Nat, and Ashley's very relaxed and very calm up there and does a fabulous job. And then a little uh, a little heart at the end yeah. and uh, gets the crowd going. And so the Tigers, Dee Dee, your, your balance beam in the first meet of the season, many comments were made that it just appeared like the Tigers were, were already in postseason form. And I know that's getting way ahead of things. It really is. But I the fact of the matter is they were pretty darn sharp. sharp. Well, they, but that's how we practice and you know there's room for improvement and and we came in here Sunday evening and the kids had a great practice didn't do a lot of hard stuff just worked on the details worked on the things that need uh, just constant reminders but you know we've got some we got a little bit of depth I, you know we didn't have Juliana in there we didn't have Kennedy in there we didn't have Lexi Priestman in there we didn't have Ashlyn Kirby in there so we've got we've got some choices and the kids are competing for their spots that's important. 49-450 on the balance beam to open the 2017 season in the Maravich Center, Dee Dee. And then, of course, it's the crowd favorite. Everybody turns, holds up the four fingers for the yeah. fourth rotation, and everybody knows that it's floor time in the PMAC. I think, I, I think our team did a terrific job. Mm -hmm. they, were, they were ready. They were eager and very anxious to show off their floor routines. Uh, Ashley Claire Kearney's done a great job, mm -hmm. once again, with the choreography. Um, it, I thought our tumbling was powerful and sharp, and we take a lot of pride in, a lot of, in doing a lot of difficulty, and I think it, it really showed. And so much emphasis on the dance portions. Mm -hmm. I know we, we're always yeah. known uh, as, as a bit of a power type school, but I tell you, the, the choreography and the dance melded with the actual power on the event. It, it's just gorgeous. A lot of movement, a lot of personality in, the, in these routines. Sydney Ewing started us off really well, tumbled. Um, a lot of power, good consistency, and um, almost everybody in that lineup is opening with big E passes in their first passes and, and finishing with, with strong Ds. But you look up and down the lineup, um, I think people were very anxious to, to, to see Lexi Priestman, and yeah. she started off great. Her full in, that first tumbling pass was fabulous. First time she's done a full floor routine in about three years. So wow. we are very excited about what she's doing. And I'd like to just kind of pause in that lineup for a moment and highlight McKenna Kelly. Because oh, yeah. it, last year it seemed like she was just uh, like, a, like, a, like a stallion shot out of the gate. She was just ready to run. Yeah. But this year it seems like that the level of composure, mm -hmm. the level of artistry is taken to another level. And boy, did it show Friday. And, and I think her, her dance is a little more mature this year. And, she she really rocked the house because that all three of her tumbling passes are really hard and any any of those passes would be anybody's first pass and she did the old Jessica Savona thing and did <laughs> tremendous difficulty throughout the routine so that was that was huge and if you had a picture of her mom up in the stands <laughs> That's right. I don't know Mary Mary Lou did not did not hold back in her in uh, her excitement about how that routine went 9925 for McKenna and then 995 for Bugs to wrap yeah. up the meet for the yeah. Tigers as LSU scores 49 475 on the floor and then the big score 197 825 DD for the meet it is the a little bit of research shows that it's the highest opening score by any school
in the last 20 years in the NCAA. That is truly remarkable. Well, the last 20 years would mean ever. <laughs> because we don't have that much history. So that, that I didn't That's know quite, that. Y'all can dig up some facts. Well, that was we, amazing. Yeah. But you know what? We didn't talk about Maya Hambrick's all-around score. Right. That was huge. Well, the 39.575, <clears throat> yeah. one of the highest scores that she's had uh, in her three-plus years now as a Tiger heading into and her. She makes it look so easy. Right. You know, she's, but that's how she does in practice, too. She's just kind of like a dude. She just, you know, does, <laughs> does her stuff and, you know, does her homework and does what she's supposed to do, and then she rocks the house. And we'll rock the house a little bit more after this time out here inside LSU Gymnastics. We'll be right back. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Assurance Financial. David specializes in helping first-time home buyers, offering conventional FHA, VA, RD construction, and jumbo loans. David takes the hassle out of getting a home loan while making you feel right at home. Lending the way you like it. Call David today at 921-8152. That's 921-8152. David Alello with Assurance Financial. You're a mom the moment you see that second line. And it's time to get ready, because this birthday takes months to plan. Find the doctor who just clicks with you. Make a birth plan that's right for you. Because every woman wants something different, even you and your BFF. And when it's finally time, our doctors and nurses will be by your side as you bring your beautiful baby into this world. The best birthday ever is at Woman's. experience miracles dozens of times a day introducing the sports app on the all-new contour from cox it's cable tv reimagined to get you right to the good stuff cox official communications partner of lsu athletics Athletic Foundation, preserving the past, celebrating the present, and building the future of LSU athletics. Take it up, Jay. Take it up, Jay. You ready? Let's get it. Let's get it, right? Let's get it. Let's get it. Okay, Oh, thanks. I got you. I will. Not now, Karen. Count it. Violin. I got you. So Team on one, team on one, one, two. This segment of Inside LSU Gymnastics is brought to you by Sigma Engineers. Sigma Engineers is thankful to our clients who trust us year after year and to the commitment of our selfless employees who bring such great talents to our company. With experts in every discipline, our dedication to safety and quality sets us apart as one of the leaders in the petrochemical industry. From the LSU Gymnastics Training Center here in Baton Rouge, this is Inside LSU Gymnastics. We're delighted that you're back with us. Dee Dee, uh, once a year, you're able to have all of the alumni, both men and women, yeah. come back to campus and uh, spend some time and attend a meet. And it was Friday night was the opportunity for that. And it was really, really great to see just dozens upon dozens back on campus. It was so much fun. You know, we, we started on Friday with the with the meet and we had kids come and came in from all over. Just an example, Elizabeth Wilson mm. and say her last name. Poplowski. Poplowski. Um, they live in Virginia and she brought her nine year old son and they did everything there was to be done. They snuck into the PMAC and shot basketballs and then uh, went to the gymnastics meet, uh, went out to eat, you know, had a, a great experience, went downtown, sure. uh, went to the track meet. <laughs> I mean, she just did absolutely everything. Went to the men's basketball game and, you know, touched base with Dan Barnet, who she knew when she was here in school, and just did, went to lunch with Miriam. She was in Miriam's wedding. So, I mean, there were just so many great things that happened. And then had a, a brunch on Saturday at right. Rafino's. He just opened the doors, and the food was incredible, and we had such a great time. And, you know, I hope any of my alumni that weren't here 
will come for the next one. Well, and we have a great opportunity to take you behind the scenes with the weekend that our alumni had here on the campus of LSU. This week's Inside Feature brought to you by Sigma Engineering. Sigma Engineers and Constructors. Safety, relationships, quality, excellence. Engineering done right. Prior to its season opener, LSU hosted the annual alumni reunion at the Maravich Assembly Center. Scores of Tiger gymnasts, both women and men, represented over 40 years of purple and gold tradition. The event was a great opportunity to reconnect with former teammates. Um, it means everything. Dee Dee was such a big part of our lives and, um, you know, just supporting the team and supporting LSU Gymnastics and everything it means, you know, it's just amazing every year to keep coming back and it keeps getting bigger. So it's pretty awesome. <laughs> Alumni is, it's everything. I mean, I don't, I try to make it back every year and I think we've been pretty good about it. A lot of us have, but um, it's definitely nice to see everybody where they are each year and just, you know, just reconnecting. I mean, it's like our home, so it's just great to be back. And Super fun. This was our family for so many years, and so it is good to see everybody all together and this many years later. <laughs> it's so important because we're all just a big family. LSU Gymnastics does not leave you when you graduate. We're all a huge family. We stay in touch over Facebook. We stay in touch over the meets when we come back all together, and it's just so great to see everyone and talk about old times, meet prep from a long time ago, meet day, what it used to be like for us. So it's just really great to relive those memories with your old teammates. The former Tigers were quick to point out how much the program has improved under Coach Bro. Dee Dee just always pushes forward. She never settles. She always wants the best out of everyone and she gets the best out of her team every year. My senior year we won regionals and that was like our huge milestone and now to make Super 6 every single year is amazing. It's amazing. In a show of solidarity, Coach Bro also includes members of the LSU men's gymnastics team, which was disbanded in the 1980s. Fabulous ladies program now. We've been supporting them for the last 15 years. Uh, my wife and I live in Alabama and we come back and we actually go visit uh, Dee Dee when she takes the team to Auburn, Alabama, Georgia and Florida. So we, my wife and I get all dressed up and we go support the Tigers. The alumni reunion not only gives the Tigers a chance to catch up with old friends, it's a welcoming event for their growing families as well. All these girls were a part of our, it was our family for so many years and now we can all come bring our little ones and it's all part of it all over again. It's home. This is home for me. I grew up here and came to LSU events growing up as a child with my dad and to be on the team was such an honor and a big responsibility and it's, it's great to come back. Reporting for Inside LSU Gymnastics, I'm Garrett Walbert. What's wrong, big guy? All I wanted was a chance to play today. You know it's tough, kid, but we've both been in your shoes before. Yeah, right. You guys are great. Come on, I have someone you want to meet. You know the only way to become great is to learn from a legend. Hey, gang, come on in here. We're going to talk some football. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Assurance Financial. David specializes in helping first-time home buyers, offering conventional FHA, VA, RD construction, and jumbo loans. David takes the hassle out of getting a home loan while making you feel right at home. Lending the way you like it. Call David today at 921-8152. That's 921-8152. David Alello with Assurance Financial. Today is your day to play. Get the top brands for low prices every day. Academy. 1977. Disco, bell bottoms, and Ford F-Series starts at Tefik Run as the best-selling trucks in America. 
2017, F-Series is still king for 40 straight years. Why? Rock-solid durability, up to the nanosecond technology, and jaw-dropping capability. Ford F-Series, America's best-selling trucks for 40 straight years. Get an F-150 with 0 for 60, plus current F-Series owners get an additional 4000 in owner loyalty cash on a new 2016 F-150, only at your Southern Quality Ford dealer. At LSU, we're pretty competitive. We helped prove Einstein's theories about gravity. Nailed it. France designated our French program as a center of excellence. We've discovered 41 species of birdies. LSU, we're pretty competitive because we're here to win. LSU Tigers fans, show your pride with real Tigers gear from the official online store, lsushop.net. You'll find everything a Tigers fan needs, including jerseys, sideline gear, polos, t-shirts, hats, and more. With an awesome selection of products, including official team merchandise from Nike, when it comes to Tigers pride, there's only one place real Tigers fans go, lsushop.net. This segment of Inside LSU Gymnastics is brought to you by Assurance Financial. When you find the home you want to buy, choose a mortgage lender that can help you buy it. David Alello with Assurance Financial. Lending the way home buyers prefer it. Welcome back Inside LSU Gymnastics. And this week's Look Ahead is brought to you by David Alello with Assurance Financial. Lending the way home buyers prefer it. Dee Dee, looking ahead, it never gets easier here in the SEC. You take on Georgia, yeah. defeat them in the PMAC Friday night, and now it's on the road for the first time in the 2017 campaign. Go to the Capstone in Tuscaloosa. Yeah, Thursday we, we head out. Uh, the kids are excited about it, you know, in the sleeper bus, and they, you know, are going to head out and uh, after class, because classes start Wednesday. Mm. So we'll leave after they get done with classes on Thursday, um, get there, have dinner. Um, do a little bit of stretching mm -hmm. and uh, get ready on Friday to take on, I think, the number three ranked That's right. um, Crimson Tide. And they're a great team, always great, always well prepared. So it'll be a good competition. Coleman Coliseum, 730 if you'd like to catch it on the SEC Network. It'll be live again. Yeah. And, and Dee Dee, just a moment on, on what that has done, that live exposure on the SEC Network and the ability for our Tiger fans to see yeah. it week in and week out. Wow. Well, I love it that they can see us on the road, and it really has um, encouraged a lot of our fans to travel sure. to see us because they enjoy the competitions here so much. But uh, SEC Network, the Friday Night Heights has really lit it up for gymnastics. It's, it's a real platform for us to show what a great sport this is. It's the number one Tigers, the number three Crimson Tide from Coleman Coliseum on Friday night on the SEC Network. Check your listings, and you can catch it at 7.30, Dee Dee, the yeah. eighth time in school history that the Tigers are number one in the land after week one. Congratulations on that. I'm glad you keep track of that stuff, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> and, and go Tigers. Absolutely. Yeah. And we thank you for joining us as always inside LSU Gymnastics. It's an honor to be here with Dee Dee each and every week inside this beautiful facility. And we're thanking you for joining us once again this week, and we'll see you next week inside LSU Gymnastics.